all of our fans. So we are setting off for another amazing road trip adventure. This is two years after our first amazing road trip adventure. You may remember two years ago, it was two summers ago, we made our big trek to California. You remember that, Oliver? Oliver's like, yeah, I have many memories of this trip. Many long days in the car. And he did really well. So uh, last summer we came back from California after a year in California. And now we're going to do the whole thing again, except this time we're going to do it in one month. We're going to go to British Columbia and then to the Bay Area. British Columbia to see my family and the Bay Area to see Wayne's family. And yeah, so what do you think, Wayne? Are you excited about this trip? Let's go. All right, let's go. So, all right, come on, let's go, Oliver. I'm going to take off. I'm going to turn the car on. Okay, well, not literally taking off. This is not an airplane, but here we go. We're backing out of our garage, Oliver. We're on our way. made it. We're in Minneapolis now after a six hour drive. So it's a little bit after nine and we're at the Cheesecake Factory. So we're going to get some food here. All right, we got Cheesecake Factory. Yes, what do you think? That's our dinner. Excited? Sounds, smells pretty good. Yeah, okay, he's like not entirely convinced. <laughs> I think it's, um, they didn't have, they didn't have the room type that we booked, so. It was this instead, which is great. Bigger. This is, I've never seen a hotel room like this. It's yeah. Like or something. Whole bed for you, Oliver. How about this one? Let me do this one. We have some dinner, Oliver? Big factory, Oliver. You're definitely gonna get this, okay?
So Wayne has gone downstairs to get some coffee and breakfast, and Oliver is waiting. <laughs> Let's see how Oliver reacts when Wayne comes back. You ready? There he is! There he is, Oliver! A little bit underwhelming, Oliver. Oh, now he jumps down. Oh, looks like a good breakfast, Oliver. You want some hotel food? Hotel breakfast? Is it oatmeal? Plain oatmeal? You want oatmeal, Oliver? Do you want sausage? He's more into the sausage. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, Oliver, you can have some sausage. <laughs> Looks like we got some extra sausage for you, Oliver. There's three patties. Oatmeal and sausage for breakfast. Oh, you want my egg? Oh. Come on, Oliver, let's go. We are going to North Dakota today, Oliver. You've already been to North Dakota. He's like, ugh, I was there last summer. All right, so we are now saying goodbye to beautiful Minneapolis. It's really nice here, but we have a long journey to make to British Columbia, so we gotta go. We're going to North Dakota today. It's a seven hour trip in the car, so that's gonna be a little bit long. And today is hot. It is 90, gonna be 97 degrees Fahrenheit. Oliver is already pretty hot even though it's still the morning and yeah we are going to Dickinson North Dakota Oliver has been to North Dakota before but not to this part of North Dakota so yeah Oliver what do you think you want to go to North Dakota and thanks to everyone at the Homewood Suites in Minneapolis we had a great time we especially loved the picture of the beagle in the elevator Oliver definitely felt welcome at the Homewood Suites in Adina Adina Minnesota All right, so we're in Fargo, North Dakota at Culver's Restaurant, and the door is locked. <laughs> Oliver, you can't have your beef pot roast sandwich. You're locked. Uh, you got the keys? Okay. There you go. <laughs> we are going to open the door now, Oliver, so you can have your very own beef pot roast sandwich. What do you think? You want to try it? Okay. I don't think Oliver's ever had one of these before, but they're pretty amazing. What do you think, Oliver? <laughs> oh, you like it? Yeah, I think he likes it. Oh, wow, Oliver, you're gonna get everywhere. Okay, we might need to get you out of the car and put it in a bowl or something. But yes, he's gonna eat this whole sandwich. So let's go, Oliver. Oh, there's a little bit here, you missed. Oh my God, I dropped it. Oh, I guess Oliver will now have to eat it from here. Have to eat it from here? Okay, I guess, yeah. This is the part of the beef pot roast sandwich that didn't touch the ground. The rest is sadly gonna have to go into the trash because I dropped it. Okay, that was pretty good. He just inhaled that. He just inhaled that. That was like three seconds and it was gone. Okay, Oliver, I'm sorry for dropping your sandwich on the ground and in atonement I will give you the rest of my chicken sandwich. Here you go. It's pretty good, wasn't it? Want a bun? Of course he wants the bun. We're in Dickinson, North Dakota. We're 
getting food at Country Kitchen in Bruce Turkey. Oh, we're just excited. The food is here. Finally. Okay, we're going inside now. But yeah, we got our food. Okay, so we are in the Candlewood Suites in Dickinson, North Dakota. Come on, this is our room. Wanna go check it out? Here we go. Good smells here. Lots of sniffing happening. excitement than last night. Why is that, Oliver? Oh, okay. Now you change your mind. Oh, that bed's very high. I don't know if you can up there, Oliver. Can you do it? Can you get up? Okay, here we go. Okay. Oliver. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bed. You like it? It's a good bed. Oliver approved. I think he's sparking more because he's saying, I've been in the car all day and this is finally our destination and I'm happy about it. Dickinson, North Dakota. We're saying goodbye to Dickinson this morning and we are heading to Montana. Yeah, so this is my first time ever in Montana. It's Oliver's first time ever in Montana. This is day three of Oliver's amazing road trip adventure and finally we're heading to a new state that we've never seen before. So yeah, tonight we're going to be in Great Falls, Montana. It's about a seven hour drive from here so it's a little bit of a long day in the car again. It's a little bit cooler today than yesterday which is great. First though, we are going to Theodore Roosevelt National Park right here in North Dakota before we cross the border. So we're gonna check that out first. It's only about a half hour away. So he's gonna to get to do some walking around in a national park. So come on over, you ready to go? You ready to have another day full of adventures? All right, let's go. Our driving there, hiking there. All right. Center's going to be adjusting it on your left. All right. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Okay. So we are at Theodore Roosevelt National Park, and we are at something called a Prairie Dog Metropolis. Oliver, let's go see the Prairie Dogs. So I think probably Oliver's favorite thing about the prairies is prairie dogs so let's go check them out oliver it says do not feed the prairie dogs and i don't know how far we can go here oh look i can see one running oliver i don't know that we're allowed to go too far from the parking lot oliver and look look oliver what's over there what's over there can you smell them it's bison oliver look at all the bison oh oh the prairie dogs they're starting to chirp the sound of the alarm. They can sense that you're here, Oliver. They can see you. Okay, I think this is pretty much as far as we're about to go, Oliver. All right. So Oliver gets to see prairie dogs again. Well, at least from a distance. And smell them. Head 
I don't know if you can hear that, but the bison are actually making a kind of groaning noise in the distance. We can hear them snorting. Oliver, can you smell them? Where are we going? Oh my goodness, Oliver just stepped in this big bison paddy. That's where his footprint was. Uh, I think we might have to clean his paw when we get back to the car. So we are definitely on the prairie. We've seen prairie dogs now and bison. It's pretty amazing out here. Beautiful day. Theodore Roosevelt National Park. Come on over, let's go. seen a wild horse before. Look Oliver, bison. Oliver, Oliver, look, right there. Bison. Oliver, right out there. Look, right there. National Park. So Wayne, what do you think of Montana so far? Uh, it's definitely a little bit drier than North Dakota. I mean, we're starting to see the landscape change slowly. Oliver, we're ready to pump gas, but there's a huge grasshopper right on the handle. So we are in Glendive, Montana at a drive-thru. What's this drive-thru called? Frosty's. Frosty's. And Oliver is super excited about this drive-thru. Oliver, we're going to get our food soon. It's going to come out this window. Here we go, Thank Oliver. You. We got our food. We got our food. So, Oliver. Oliver, I think we got some burgers in there. And some roast chicken for you. Oh, all right, no worries. He'll be right out. Okay. So we are at the Frosties in there in Glendive, Montana. And Oliver, you've got your very own chicken sandwich here. So I'm just gonna give it to you in your bowl. Oh, it's hot. It's really hot. Okay, I'm gonna put some water on it to cool it down. I think it's a little bit too hot to eat right now. Oh, it's too hot for even, even to tear it apart. Okay, what am I gonna do? I'll have to get a knife and fork. Be back in a sec. It's lunch for you, Oliver. Is it cool enough to eat? I think it is now. Okay, so that was Frosty's, and I was very impressed. Friendliest drive through employees ever. Oliver and was very impressed too. Great burgers, and Oliver really liked his chicken burger. Yeah, we pretty much inhaled that lunch. It was so good. We ate it in about four minutes flat, 
you always eat pretty fast when you're eating with Oliver. And now we are heading to Great Falls, Montana. So, mm -hmm. Oliver, right. let's go. So we are on a completely deserted highway in Montana. It looks like they're repairing it. I guess we should really have come this way. What do you think, Oliver? How do you feel about this highway? Apparently we've got to wait here at this red light. I don't know how long, but we'll let you know how it goes. All right, I think something's happening. The pilot car has arrived and it's gonna guide us through this one lane stretch of construction. truck. It's kicking up an awful lot of dust. Let's keep those windows closed. What do you think, Oliver? Keep the windows closed a long while longer. Pilot turned green. Yay, let's go. And that truck says, pilot car, follow me. Okay, we're following. A big dust cloud. Oliver knows that this is not normal. I can see pavement now, Oliver. Oliver, we made it back. We made it back to paved road. Oliver, are you excited? We're almost there. And we are back on the pavement. All right, yay, we made it. Thank you, pilot car. Okay, Oliver, everything's back to normal now. You can relax. So as you can see, the rest stops in Montana are a little bit desolate looking, but Oliver doesn't seem to mind. Hey Oliver, I'm back. I just went to the bathroom. some free microwave popcorn waiting for us in the room and this is actually the very first time that we have ever made microwave popcorn with Oliver. Oliver does not seem at all perturbed. What do you think of all that popping sounding, Oliver? Interesting smell. Do you like it? Do you want some? Have you ever smelled anything like that before? It smells pretty good. Hot, buttery popcorn. I know you like popcorn. You've had popcorn before. Just not microwave popcorn. <laughs> You're tired of waiting. 
Okay, so it's gonna be very hot. We'll have to pause the video here while I open it. You wanna try this popcorn over? Let's see how hot it is. Are you interested? Oh, oh that's dangerous putting it out there. Hey, I haven't even seen how hot it is yet. Let's see how hot. Yeah, that's way too much for one beagle. How about I put it over here? And then Oliver, we're gonna play catch, okay? One, two, three. Oh, you got it! No, not really. <laughs> you got a little bit of it. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, no, that was bad. That was my fault. Okay, we'll do another one. One, two, three. I'll do it this way. Yes, good job, Oliver. Okay, underhand is much better. One, two, three. Yeah, you got it again. He loves this game. One, two, three. All right, you don't even need the one, two, three. Here we go. All right, good job, Oliver. You can have, oh yeah, you want this one to calm the ground? Okay, you can have 10 more, then that's it, Oliver. 10? 10 more, is that too much? <laughs> okay, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight. Oh, that was two at once. <laughs> Nine, and ten. Yay, you got it. Good job, Oliver. Ten out of ten. You're amazing at catching popcorn. Good job. All right, Taylor fans. It is morning in Great Falls, Montana. Oliver's awake. And he is very suspicious because we just got some hotel breakfast from downstairs and he can smell it. He doesn't know where it is. Alder, show us where it is. Can you find it? You're on the scent. Don't give up. Yeah, keep going. Keep looking. Where is it? Oh, getting closer. Oh, it's somewhere there? Where is it? Is it over here? Where is it? Here? Mm. Yeah? It's there? Oh, come on. Show me. Here. Show me. From here? Mm. Yeah. Very good. It is here. Yes, you're very good at sniffing and smelling things. Okay, I'll give you a, maybe a little bit of sausage, okay? Good boy, yes. Okay, it's good set. Give me some sausage. Okay. <laughs> Not sure. All right. Have some breakfast now. Good tailwind. Come on, let's go. Oh, good stretch. Really good stretch. Good yawn. Okay. Let's go to the park. It's our second national park of this trip. It's really tall mountains and apparently glaciers. Okay, we're heading off to Glacier National Park. Hey, Oliver friends, we are now at St. Mary Lake here in Glacier National Park. It is extremely windy today and we are about to get rained on, but ironically enough, we are going on this road called Going to the Sun Road. So hopefully we'll see some sunshine a little bit later today. All right, Oliver, you ready to go? We're gonna go, we're gonna go right through the park. Yeah, let's go. So Oliver is totally into the smells in the forest here by St. Mary Lake. I think he smells some little forest creatures or something. So he's definitely on the track of some kind of scent. Or maybe he just wants someone's lunch. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Oliver. No, 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 no. Don't take someone else's lunch, please. 
Okay, they're just having a picnic. No, Oliver, that's not yours. That's not yours. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oliver. Okay. Wow. That mountain is so beautiful. It reminds me a little bit of the mountains next to Lake Louise. And we're actually pretty much in the same mountain range. We're just a little bit further south here in Glacier National Park. Oliver, let's not get too close. That's a big horn sheep eating some bushes. We are going to stay our distance. <laughs> Good roll, Oliver. Good roll. Good roll on the grass. Yes. Good roll. Hey, it's almost, he keeps looking up like he's checking. Are you watching me? Are you watching me while I roll? What did you think of the park, Oliver? It was pretty cool, wasn't it? Yeah. Remember those big horned sheep we saw? They were amazing. Do you think they were amazing? I thought they were pretty cool. And we saw an actual glacier too. Jackson Glacier. Yeah. It was a great day. So now we are heading to our, it's not a campground tonight, but it is a koa. We're gonna actually have a little cabin. So it's a little bit different than the last few days when we've been in hotels. Oliver, we're gonna be in a cabin. You're just eating grass. He'll be excited once we get there. He loves cabins. Okay, Oliver, I'm gonna unleash you now so you can go check out our cabin. Take off your collar too. Go ahead. Oh, wow. Bunk beds. We have bunk beds too, it's so cute. Yeah, we have a little bathroom. <laughs> yeah, you like it? That's good. The best part about being a, the best part of being in a cabin, Oliver, is you can bark as much as you want. No one will hear you. Oliver's already made some frenemies, which are the German shepherds over there. 
So we've got a little competition going on. He was barking at them just now, they work back. Maybe we'll have to become friends with them later. <laughs> you don't like the fly? Wow, you wow. just nailed that all okay. Another course coming up. I'll check this time. There we go. There we go. Okay, so we don't have steers, but we do have rocks and forks. <laughs> Okay, so there, there's two pieces of chicken and two pieces of steak in this bowl. Let's see which one eats first. Oh, we think he went for chicken. A man for a steak. Okay, wait, I can't even tell. He just ate like all four all at once, so there's really no order. Okay, Oliver. Okay, so we are at Glacier National Park, and this is an actual glacier. It is called, uh, what is it called, Wayne? Jackson Glacier. Everyone knows it's at me. It's called Jackson Glacier. Look over.